the next event will be one fall. Introducing in this corner, 230 pounds, Abdullah the Arab. His opponent in this corner, 234 pounds, from San Francisco, Steve Pardee. Well, the way he's going, I'm surprised he didn't save him Frisco. <laughs> Abdullah the Sheikh is what he is generally called. He's from Saudi Arabia. And we haven't heard anyone call somebody Arab since Ahab the Arab, Ray Stevens. Western music fame. And the Arab, if you will, doesn't want his boots checked. The toes particularly. The knees being checked. And he doesn't want those uh, little pointy toes to be checked out. Sandy Barr got a good look at one of them. Circle, Steve Pardee. They locked up, go against the ring, the ropes. Steve Pardee right away turns to the referee. They lock up again into the ropes. Sandy by the referee breaking. Accusing Abdullah pulling here. They circle again. Into the ropes. Break is called. Hardy getting a little hot at Abdullah. Side headlock. Abdullah thrown off, double slingshot go, and who's going to make the move? Abdullah steps out, gets the hip toss, comes back with a flying tackle. Party dives underneath that one, catches him with a hip toss. And arm drag slam up with a wing lock. Well, some new faces wrestling earlier on tonight's card, P.G. Stone. A tattooed man showed himself. Very, very tough customer. Mike Ellen appeared on tonight's card. Coming in about the time you'll be watching the show in Washington, uh, these two dynamo wrestlers, we are told, they really, one in fact takes the name, the Dynamite Kid. Supposed to be sensational as is Terry Gibbs, young man out of Atlanta, Georgia, who we are told is better than Steve Regal was. And that's doing pretty good. Rip Oliver still holding the heavyweight championship for the Pacific Northwest. As of this taping. Rear headlock being worked by Abdullah the Sheik. to the midsection, another, and another. Pardee driving it home on Abdullah. Abdullah, knee lift, side of the head. Sandy Barr, dandy Sandy Barr is the referee. Today's matches. Frank Bonema calling the action. Glad to have you with us on Big Time Wrestling. Snap Mare for the takedown. Wherever you might be watching us from, we're glad you're along. We come to a great many of you, hundreds of thousands, we estimate, over Q13, KCPQ, 
4,400 block offices in Tacoma, Washington, 4,400 block of Stillicum. And if you're over east of the mountains, you might be watching us on KIMA out of Yakima, KEPR in Kennewick or KLEW in Lewiston. And wherever you are watching, if you care to drop us a line, we'd appreciate your letting management know what uh, the program director, general manager of the station on which you're watching, know that you watch the show and enjoy it. We wish you'd let us know if you don't enjoy it for any reason. Have any comments you'd like to make? We can't always accommodate the suggestions. Some of them are physical impossibilities. But we try. We at least take a look at them. Probably the best way to get in there is a letter is send it to Big Time Wrestling. Care of... Uh, Probably the best thing to do is send it to, say, KCPQ. More than likely, if you send it to Keeper, Clue, or KIMA, we'll get it. The whip into the other corner. Abdullah working on Steve Party. Knee lift. Nails Party. R.D. has as his mentor Red Bastine, a fine wrestler back in the 60s particularly. Also the 50s and into the 70s. Coming off of the top rope, double club blow by Abdullah. R.D., a protege, if you will, of Red Bastine's. Got him into the business. First taught him 